The electrocorticograph consists of four roughly five centimeter long electrode strips. Each strip contains four small electrodes. The electrode strips are implanted inside the skull against the brain. Two of the electrode strips are placed over the region of the left motor cortex that controls hand movements, while the other two are placed over the left prefrontal cortex as a backup. The electrode strips are connected to a transmitter device that is installed inside the left side of the patient's chest. The implant wirelessly connects to a receiver via an antenna and to a tablet computer mounted on the user's wheelchair. The patient thinks about moving her right hand to activate the electrodes, which triggers the electrodes to send signals down to the transmitter in the chest. This allows the patient to move a cursor with her hand to make an input on the computer screen. If the patient's motor cortex degenerates over time, the backup electrodes placed over the left prefrontal cortex will be activated. To control these electrodes, the patient has to count backwards, as this region is responsible for mental calculation.